Amazon tribes are learning to use technology to help protect their land from the impact of deforestation by illegal loggers and land grabbers in Brazil. Nature, for us, is the life of the Indian. We don't want to see the jungle chopped down. If you chop it all down, it will definitely be hotter and there won't be a river or hunting or pure air for us. 28-year-old Awapo Uroawawa is one of a new generation learning to use drones to detect deforestation. He's part of a training program for indigenous communities and others who work in forest protection run by the World Wildlife Fund and local NGO, the Kanende Ethno-Environmental Defense Association. They really accept the technology of open arms and pretty quickly start to use it. We know that in Brazil, the government doesn't have all the resources needed to protect the Amazon. It's very important that they are part of this process. Awapu's tribe, the Uru Awawa, first came into contact with people from outside their community in the early 1980s. Their land is a protected area of almost 7,000 square miles of rainforest in the Brazilian state of Rondonia. An increase in illegal deforestation and forest fires is threatening their indigenous way of life, destroying the forests they depend on for growing and gathering food and for clean air and water. Out on patrol, Awapu and his team used the drones to find and document areas of deforestation, collecting high resolution images, video, and mapping data to use as evidence when reporting illegal activities to the authorities. Look at the size of the deforested area here. It's huge. We send the drone up here too. There is no end to it. The, the key is not uh, to think of the technology, of course, as a silver bullet, um, but it's pairing that tool along with indigenous knowledge um, that makes it it's so much more powerful. Having an intricate history and understanding of, you know, what are the areas that are most important to protect? Where are there, you know, routes that animals pass through right, that need to be cared for. Keeping the forest intact is crucial to protecting the rich biodiversity of this Amazon region, home to over 180 species of mammals and more than 600 species of birds. It is also vital to the state's water supply. Water from there irrigates all the fields outside it. It irrigates the soya, the pastures, if you destroy the water, you are destroying your economy. For his work protecting the forest, Awapu says he has faced death threats from land grabbers and illegal loggers, but he is determined, with the help of this technology, to continue the fight for future generations. My hope is that while I'm alive, I want to see the jungle standing, the jungle intact. That is my hope. Tell us what you're doing to preserve the health of the planet for future generations. Send us your messages on social media using the hashtag call to earth.